Hey, hey guys, I am back. I'm sorry, you can probably hear the kids downstairs running around and yelling and screaming. I don't know what it is. I have you guys up on like a plastic tub thing on my bed. So like for some reason, like the sound comes up through that. Like I don't hear it as loud as you guys can. So, but today we are eating some deep fried corn dogs and I got some of these little guys, which are actually cinnamon toast crunch bites. I deep fried these two. I don't know if they're supposed to be, because it says microwave and oven directions only, but I put them in the deep fryer, because yeah. And today I'm drinking some fruit punch Gatorade and I got a cup of mayonnaise, mustard, and ketchup for my corn dogs. I have four corn dogs here. I'm probably not going to eat all four. We'll see. Let me set this over here. I got the TV on so we can maybe watch people do stupid stuff on Discovery Channel. All right. So I'm gonna take the first one here. Yeah, I don't have any makeup on. I need to take a shower. I don't get time to myself because I've got all three kids. <laughs> and they just fixed our shower yesterday, so I can't use my nice one. Oh, they're so crunchy. I love them when they're deep fried. Like, they get really crispy. When you microwave them, they just kind of stay mushy. So, and I just kind of mix, mix it together lightly. So, if you guys eat corn dogs, what do you put on them? Or hot dogs in general. Expedition Unknown is what's on. I mute it during the commercials because if they play music and you guys can hear the music, YouTube will be like, nope. Copyright. So. Gotta be careful with what you post, I guess. These guys are like going into some cave or something. Oh, yes. It's 1.40 and I haven't, I haven't eaten anything today. And I actually skipped my coffee because I wanted to see like how I could go without any caffeine in the morning. I'm doing all right, so we'll see. I think a lot of it's like mental, like thinking, oh my gosh, I have to have caffeine or I'm not going to be able to make it more so than it is like a physical thing. And if you're new, subscribe to my channel, become a part of my family. I'm slowly climbing, slowly getting more and more subscribers. One of my neighbors, um, the people that live a couple doors down from me, 
who I was like, the first time I met them, I was like, I'm going to love these guys. They're so cool. Um, the mom knows that I have a mukbang channel. And she's always asking me what I'm eating and stuff. And she said she wants to do a video with me. She said, you can make me eat some seafood if your guys don't mind puking. <laughs> and I was like, whoa, I'm not that kind of channel. Like, I eat food and people just watch me eat. She thinks it's weird, but she understands it. See, there's more mustard than... I didn't think I put that much in there. Oh, see, the bottom's like more ketchup. That's why. But she wants to do a video with me. She just had she has no filter at all. <laughs> Which is cool. Like that's what makes me like her. And the kids are like always going down to her house. And I'll, like, migrate down there to, you know, make sure my kids aren't, like, being annoying. Which I know they are. Um. Every time I go over, after I'm there for, like, five or ten minutes, she's like, come on inside. And so we go inside, and every time she starts, like, pouring shots. And she's like, here, let's drink, let's drink. She's really cool. And my guys are like best friends with their youngest daughter. And then they have an older daughter who actually just graduated high school a couple days ago. And then they have a middle daughter Who's nine? I think she's nine. And she's got Down syndrome. And it's not like mild Downs either. It's like she can't talk. She's still in diapers and all that kind of stuff. And Arya's just so intrigued. Like even Munch. With as little as Munch is, she knows that she's different. So, but the mom really likes, likes us because we weren't like staring and just being like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. You know, like a lot of people are like, Aria was like, hi, and you know, what's, what's her name and what's wrong with her? Why, why is she not potty trained? Why is she still in diapers and why can't she talk and Stuff like that. But the cool thing is, is that my kids are starting to learn sign language because of her. So, that's pretty awesome. Mm. Oh my gosh. It's like the outside's super crispy. And then it's like doughy and soft in the middle. And then you just got the hot dog. And usually I eat these little bits. <laughs> mm. I've never had these cinnamon toast crunch thingies though. So we'll see what these are like. I looked all over the box and I was like, it doesn't say deep fry, but I'm just going to go ahead and drop one in and I checked to make sure that it wasn't going to explode and it didn't. So I was like, all right.
My TV just like froze. We've been having some issues with, I don't know if it's like from like the Verizon side of it, like the cable company, or if it's from like our security company, because our security system's having issues too. Like it's still working and everything, but it's not recording when people ring the doorbell. And it's supposed to record for like 40 seconds or something. And it'll start recording as somebody's coming up the step, like up the driveway. See, now it's just saying like, okay, we can't play the TV anymore. Here's Scott yelling at one of the kids. Mm. He's telling them he can't, they can't go and knock on their door. Like, they barely even pull into the driveway and Ari is like, can Claire play? Can Claire play? Can Claire play? And it's, it's like, they are not even out of their car yet, Aria. Like, Aria's really pushy. probably hear that we don't live far from a military base so we have a lot of like military helicopters and stuff go by Quen dog number three they're just so good when they're deep fried oh the tv's like hey maybe 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 i'll come back <clears throat> no lacroix burps today all right, so I'm just mixing the rest of this in. Oh, yes. Oh, come on. Oh, you can do it. You can do it. Yeah, it's back. And they said my um, countertop for the bathroom will be in on Tuesday. And Tuesday, I also have to go back and get another cortisone shot. Like, I would rather have surgery than have shots. Drink. This is like a history lesson too. So they're like teaching you about the area and stuff. They're like down in some mines. They're somewhere in South America. <clears throat> Ooh, yes.
Oh, this will be the last corn dog, and then I'm gonna try a couple of the cinnamon toast crunch bites. It says they're soft donut bites with a sweet cinnamon filling. They don't look like they do on the box, though. I'll show you the difference. It doesn't say they're new or anything, but it's the first time we've gotten them. I don't know who got them either. I'm wondering if I should start doing like shout outs and stuff for people. Because I was watching um, Canadian Mukbang and she mentioned it and she commented on one of my videos. She's like, oh, I love your videos. I want to give you a shout out. And I told her, yeah, go ahead. But it's funny because I was thinking the same thing like a couple days ago about just being like giving a shout out to this person today, this person, you know. So crunchy. Okay, so this is what these things look like on the box. Let me get like a good looking one too. I guess this guy is okay. <clears throat> so it's not like coated in sparkling sugar because you see how that sugar's like glittery <laughs> mine's not sparkling but they're just a little flat on the bottom and then i mean they had a little dusting of it but it wasn't like coated like these look like they've been wet like wet on the top and then like shoved into it and like put a ton more on there So let's try one of these. I'm going to bite this one open because it says that it has the cinnamon filling. Hey. They lie. Do you see that filling on this one? It could be because I deep fried them and I didn't put them in the oven or the microwave like it says, but. Alright, see so now that first bite didn't even have any of the cream in it. Okay. It reminds me slightly of the the Pillsbury cinnamon rolls, like the ones in the can that you can put in the oven and then you drizzle like the glazed stuff on top of them. It 
It doesn't taste like Cinnamon Toast Crunch, though. Like the cereal. And Cinnamon Toast Crunch is my favorite cereal. I'm going to try another one. Yeah, it doesn't taste like the cereal at all. They're good. I mean, they're not good. They're okay. Will I go out of my way to buy them again? And be like, oh yes, we need to have these because they're so delicious. No. And they're for four bites, it's 180 calories. And a lot of salt. Partially produced with genetic engineering. Yay, my favorite. <laughs> so if you want to see the nutrition facts. And the ingredients. You can go ahead and pause it. It doesn't taste like the cereal, though. Like, I would prefer to take a piece of bread and then toast it and then put a decent amount of butter on it and then just sprinkle real cinnamon and sugar on top of it. That tastes better than these. And none of them are, like, gooey, like, Filling, like the fillings dripping out, nothing like that. And I cooked them. I took them out of the fryer, set them on a paper towel, let them, like, you know, drain any of the oil off, put them on the plate, cook up, cooked up the hot dogs, and then mixed up the ketchup and stuff, and then came right up here. I already had everything set up, so I just turned the camera on and started recording. So it's not like they've been sitting out for long enough to where they could dry out, I guess. <laughs> so, not bad. So there's a few more. One more corn dog. I think three corn dogs is enough, though. If I eat too much, then I'm going to be like, I want to lay down and take a nap. <clears throat> They're all right. Nothing to write home about. Nothing that I'm going to go get on Facebook and be like, oh my god, have you guys tried these? These are amazing. And then my fruit punch Gatorade. I only started drinking this because Munch took it out of the fridge that we have in the garage. She can just open that one up real easy. The one that we have in the kitchen is... It's like the two double doors and then like the bottom freezer that pulls out. So she's not quite strong enough to break that suction yet. But the other one is like just old, older, old school fridge. So she can get that one open. We just keep drinks and stuff in there. That's the LaCroix fridge. If you guys haven't seen that video, it's only like 20 seconds where I just show a hundred cans of LaCroix in the fridge. All right, guys. Well, thanks for having lunch with me. Um, let me know if you guys want a shout out down in the comments. Um, I will uh, give shout outs. I would like to have you be subscribed if I'm going to give you a shout out. You know, I'll check and do all that stuff. Um, but if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that button. Become a member of my family. We would love to have you. And I guess I will see you guys in the next one.
Yep, I think that's it. All right. Love you guys. Bye.